<laughs> well, that wasn't much fun. Ah, say goodbye! Nonetheless. <laughs> I'd be Piccolo. Oh. One hand. What the? Hey, who are you? Your mom, bitch. Kakarot, you finally show your face. Shut the fuck up, Vegito. Go on. Here you go. It's a sensu bean. Give some to the others, too. I'm gonna fight these guys on my own. Huh, you wanna fight me? What's a puny little guy like you gonna do? There's no way you can beat me! I get a load of you! Man, you're a big talker, aren't ya? I'm gonna attack you out of four! Oh, I did it! I did it! How's this? Hey, Rick Hume! My power! Oh, oh, my oh. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Lend me your energy! Puss, puss. Hey. All right. I think it's finally time to show you my best stuff. Raccoon! Ultra! Sorry, you were wide open, so I just went for it. You, you, you. Hmm. Okay. Damn, how he's already gone beyond a Saiyan power level. But how? What kind of training has he put him? For? Are the stories more than legends? Could it possibly be? Is he the legendary Saiyan warrior that appears once every thousand years? It's not say years. Is he actually a Super Saiyan? 
What about you guys? You gonna go back to your own planet or what? Or do you want to end up like this guy over here? Whoa! You hear that, Bert, huh? This spiky head whip must be out of his... Yeah, he actually believes that he has the power to take down Raccoon. Oh, he just got lucky. Raccoon wasn't fighting at his best, that's all. Yeah, that was a fluke. I mean, his power level didn't even go over 5,000. Give me a break. Here we go! Yeah! Okay. So, you won't go back, huh? No, oh. this! rapidly increasing his power level at the exact moment he lands a strike. He, he must be trying to conserve his... That power spike is probably too quick for even their advanced scouters to detect. His power level is unbelievable. How can... Where is all this power? Do you understand now? Just give up already. And leave this planet. Oh, this must be some sort of nightmare. It's Goku, Your dude. naivete makes me sick. Why naivete? would you let them get away with that? You may have grown stronger, but that doesn't make you a Super Saiyan. Far from it. Super Saiyan? I can see that you're proud of how much you've increased your power, but that won't be nearly enough to defeat Frieza. Frieza, huh? That's the guy. Wait, so even after all the training I did, you're saying I'm still not strong enough to beat him? That's exactly what I'm telling you. 
Frieza possesses more power than you could ever possibly imagine. Uh, huh. Maybe you're wrong. I mean, you saw what Goku can do, right? I mean, those guys couldn't even lay a finger on him. Goku is unstoppable. Then fight him and find out for you. But that's not all. Frieza's probably already used the Dragon Balls to wish for him. No, I, I don't think... What? Well, if it's like using the Dragon Balls on Earth, the sky should get really dark and Shinron appears. But it's been bright this whole time, which means he probably hasn't made his wish yet. Shen what? What the heck's a Shinron? You mean something comes out of the Dragon Balls? Oh, yeah, that's right. He probably doesn't know how to summon Shenron. That means we still have a chance to make our wish. Hooray! <laughs> Appears we've got some company arriving. Looks like Jace has brought Captain Ginyu along with... Wait. I thought for sure he'd be back at his ship with the Dragon Balls that Captain Ginyu brought him. Okay. I'm sensing some massive energy over there. Uh, oh. oh. Oh no, Frieza's probably going to force Guru to... Yeah, he doesn't know. What? That settles it. Krillin and Gohan, you two get the Dragon Balls. Me and... Right. And if we don't... We have to find Bulma and get the Dragon Radar. Yeah, good idea. Good luck, guys. Goku! Goku! Come on, Vegeta, let's go. We're going to go greet those Ginyu guys. Bye. You're probably a lot stronger now that you've recovered from a near-death experience. <laughs> so you know about that, huh? <laughs> Wait a minute. If neither Frieza nor Ginyu are back at the ship, then that means the ship's completely defenseless right now. <laughs> Something wrong, Vegeta? <laughs> yeah, he's scheming. It's nothing. <laughs> okay, Jesus. Closing in. Some real guts, you know that? The captain's gonna make you pay for what you did. Dearly. So this is the guy, huh? Just like we said. Makes no sense, right? Absurd. Relying too much on your scouter is a rookie mistake. Don't Most likely. He has the ability to inch from what I can tell. I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? Say? Promising. This'll be an enjoyable battle. All right, let's do this, Vegeta. You take that smaller guy over there. Kakarot and Ginyu are more or less equal in terms of power. If I'm lucky enough, maybe the two of them might take each other out. This is the end of the line <laughs> for you. Farewell, Kakarot! Vegeta, here I go! Thank you. No, I can't believe Vegeta did something like that. I guess you probably need to the Dragon Balls while me and this guy fight it out. Oh. Lend me your hand! Oh, <laughs> 
Can't be. Are you? Are you a Super Saiyan? Vegeta said something about that too. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. S S Super Saiyan? You mean? You mean the legendary warrior? Yes. No! It is me. This cannot be. <laughs> Is this guy really the only thing in the universe that even Lord Frieza is afraid of? Dead Beerus. I don't know about that, but what I do know is that I'd like to avoid fighting if I can. So listen up. Just leave the planet. I'm saying this for your own good. What? Are you joking? No, I'm serious. I don't want to kill you guys if I don't have to. I've heard that the Super Saiyan is the ultimate warrior, one that lives only for battle and bloodshed. Oh, oh, I get it. You're not actually a Super Saiyan, are you? But be that as it may, your power is still far greater than my own power. It's true. <laughs> it's very true. What's funny? Change now. Jace, take my scouter. What, what are you doing? <laughs> that body of yours is pretty strong. Yes, and I think I'll take it. Change! <laughs> more S's though. Awkward. Whatever. <laughs> what? What's going on? What? what? What am I doing all the way over there? We've made a trade. Your body is mine now. Hey, Captain. Here's your scout. Right. Now, back to the ship. It's possible Lord Frieza may have returned already. <laughs> so this is why he damaged his own body. It all makes sense now. I'm in serious trouble. If I don't hurry, I'm... Wait, no. He's gonna meet up with Krillin and the others. That's it. Wait a second. Please tell me. Even if I make it back to Earth, Chi Chi probably wouldn't be all too happy seeing me the way I am right now. Please tell me I have to. 
I don't want to play as Captain Kenya. He seems to have sniffed us out. It won't be much longer until he's here. You must go, Dinle. And hurry. Those earthlings need you. Yep. Uh, okay. I understand, but please don't die, Grand Elder Guru. I suppose I let this one live. There's no sense wasting my time with a single speck of dust. Do I get to play his nail? What do you want? Greetings and salutations. My name is Frieza, and I've come to your humble little planet in search of the Dragon Balls. Fear not, as I have already managed to gather all seven of them. Though it would seem I am unable to draw upon their power, which is what brings me to the lot of you. Tell me what I must do in order to grant my wish. I suggest you leave. We have no intention of telling monsters like you. I would be more forthcoming if I were you. Although I do not intend to kill you, I will use force if necessary. There are two of you, yes? I don't care which one of you it is, but one of you will tell me. Fine. If that's how it's going to be, then we'll fight. But know this. Grand Elder Guru, the creator of the Dragon Balls, resides here. If you kill him, the Dragon Balls will disappear as well. Hmm? Nail, my son. You must hold him off as long as you can. Understood, my lord. I see. But I'm curious. Don't you wonder if he'll still refuse to tell me what I need to know when he sees that you're about to die? I won't go down as easy as you think. But we're not going to fight here. Wait, that's Sean Chamel. Grand Elder Guru doesn't have much longer to live. Fighting here would only hasten his end. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Very well then. Oh, I do get to. Yeah. Oh my, that's such a feat. My power level, you see. Rest assured. That's enough. I guess not. Where are the Dragon Balls? They're either here, wherever they are. Those but before they get the chance, I must mask my power. This should work. Once those runs summon that Shenron creature, it won't be long until I run into them. I should change into a new battle suit while I'm... Yes, you should. New battle suit. Krillin! The Dragon... Gotcha! Let's... Looks like all seven of them are together in one spot. Right, now's our chance. Oh, my dad's all right. Of course he's all right. He's Goku. Plus, <laughs> Vegeta's with him. Yeah, that's true. Krillin, look at that. There's the spaceship. Radar showing that the Dragon Balls aren't... Looks like no one's around. <laughs> Huh. We've got ah, so that's where they hurry and summon that Shenron once that thing makes an appearance. Harunga appears. Well, here goes. Right. Come forth, Shenron, and grant our wishes. Uh, nothing happened. What? Maybe the phrase you use is different to summon him here. Damn it! What the hell are those two? Glenn. <laughs> Two of them. And they got some wit. Does, does that. <laughs> Whoa, they dug up the. How did you do that? What do you mean? Obviously. We... Dragon radar. So, did you. Well, it's the craziest thing. Uh, you know, there's something different about you, Goku. I can't quite place it. That's a scouter, isn't it? 
ruin. Huh? I, I don't. This body no longer belongs to that Saiyan. I couldn't. Res Wait, what did you say? Hmm? And you're? Really? <laughs> wow, you actually. That's correct. I am the mighty leader of the Ginyu. <laughs> Talking as if you think they can win. Yeah, you're right about one thing. As long as my mind is separated from it, you kill fool. Let me join in the fight. Can well then. No, this can't be happening. Chase couldn't have been defeated so easily. You're next. Die! He's gonna do it. Looks like I'm back to being me again. What, what the hell just happened? What was that just now? That feels like my dad, all right. My dad, he's back in his own body. Damn it. This time, this time I'm taking Vegeta's body. <clears throat> Oh, if he switches places with Vegeta, we're all done for. Not good. Now, your body is mine, Vegeta. Oh, contrary. Perfect. Change. <laughs>
into a frog. <laughs> Tell me how to use the Dragon Balls. Tell me and I'll put an end to your suffering. I may not be able to kill that elder of yours, but you on the other consider this your final warning. <clears throat> He's going to tell them. What? Yeah, bitch. A little worm from the... Curse you! I'm not... They... No. And the... This medical machine here, it should put you back in prime condition before you know it. Oh, and might as well give you some battle suits while we're at it. That way you'll at least be somewhat protected. Huh? Battle suits? You mean like that one? I don't really like how it looks. What? Whoa, this is crazy. It's super lightweight. It feels like I'm not wearing anything at all. And these shoulder pads don't really get in the way. We have all sorts of room to move. Go on. We should head over to Guru's place while Goku's recovering. If we don't find out how to summon Shenron, then we came all the way out here for nothing. Right. Let's get going. Go find out how to activate the dragon. I am going to rest up before this fight with Frieza. Uh, okay. Let's hope we don't run into him first. Okay. That concludes this episode. See you guys.